guys, we're at D2E and we're at the IT people with Angelo and Lynn. They're going to show us some of their games. So as you are joining and all that, if you have any questions, just share it. This is live on the YouTube Spots fan page and probably airing later on my YouTube channel. We're going to start with Scarab Grand. Adam, this one's for you. So what's the concept now on this one? So if you're familiar with the original Scarab, it was a 10 play mm -hmm. to basically land Scarab halos on, on the real set. And then on the 10th spin, all of those halos that you had collected during your last, your previous 10 spins would turn into wilds. Mm -hmm. And so in Scarab Grand, we've actually moved from a four by five configuration to a four by six configuration, more wilds, more Scarabs. Yeah. And so, as how does that change the? Oh, nice, nice landing right off the bat. Um, how does that change the pay? So, in, in really, it just increases the chances of having more wilds. So, mm -hmm. this is pumping the volatility up. Okay. Okay. So, you're actually getting the chance to have punchier wins as you go through, mm -hmm. just because there's simply more more lines to be taken advantage of. You know that everyone at the casino just goes through the lines and then that's what they decide if they're going to play it or not. <laughs> exactly, exactly. We can see as we're just going through here, we're getting some really good base, mm -hmm. pay, base pays as we're building more wilds. So we went from 40 lines to 50 lines or, or 100 lines? So now we're at 75 lines. Oh, okay. So much higher. So at a dollar bet, the 25 cents go up there, right? Yep. Oh, there we go. Nice. Okay, we just need a connector. And Come some on, Cleo. Here. <laughs> yes! That should be pretty good, right? That should be really good. Oh, come on. I wanted that big win. <laughs> I will say, I feel okay. like the big win celebration on your games to a certain level has taken over what WMS had with like that big win. Like, I, I love the shaking of the screen. I love the... Um, the shaking of the screen, the coins coming out. Oh, that is so hard to get. <laughs> <laughs> so let's trigger something here. Come on. Are we yes. Up? So free games. And I think the big part about free games here is that, of course, you get to choose your volatility. And I'm going to go with five. OK. But if you get more wild go. symbols, then there's more games, right? Well, let's see what happens. Okay. <laughs> I think you picked something special for us. Oh, yes. There's that rumble again. You saw that base game just mm -hmm. trembling like we were having an earthquake. You guys have, have mastered that. that. That's very attractive. First spin, $13. Ooh, that's massive. Nice. Oh, 20 bucks. Nice. Come on, watch to the left. There we go. Yes. That's a good one. I agree with you. I think having more wilds is way better. Mm hmm But I've seen people doing less wild, really nice wins too. Yeah, because they true. go ahead and line up nicely. To get those majors in there with it, boy, it can be very lucrative. That's well, I think five. that animation changed a little bit from the original. Yep. Absolutely, we're always improving. Mm -hmm. We try to do every everything that becomes a proven performer for us. It's important for us to put an M plus one on it. Right. But to make sure we're really consistent and authentic with whatever we add to not take away the things in the base game that made it so successful in the first place. So what happened with Cleopatra Gold? <laughs> <laughs> we're not always perfect. Right. <laughs> I, on, but I would say that probably the one at um, Fort Knox, that Cleo is, is volatile, but it doesn't come across as volatile. Right, right, right. So, 60 times our wager. That's yep. not bad. No, that's not bad. That's not bad. What else are you going to show me? Let's, let's win that grand. That, that's kind of it on Scarab. I mean, really, it's the base game with extra lines, really powerful component in free spins, where you get the capacity to actually choose your volatility in free spins. So the full screen is the grand. Yes. Do you have the program? Do you have a program to hit the grand? Ow. OK, well. If Where you want doing? to, do you want to see a blackout? We can do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to see a blackout. Let's see it here. Let's see it. Here. No. Uh, no, no, no. That's okay. But I have another game that'll give you a blackout. Let's do it. Okay. Yeah. Have you seen um, our new cabinet, our new hardware cabinet, uh, the 49 Peak? 
Uh, I'm not very well versed on the cabinet, so I'm down to see it. Okay, let's go look okay. at the cabinet. And someone asked, tell them they need to put out another rich little piggies. Rich little piggies. Is that yours? I don't know if that is yours. Jonathan, I think that... Yeah. on the course side because I do a lot of premium. We're at IGT, uh, Jonathan. We're going over to Wheel of Fortune, Mystery Link. Okay. Is there a reason why the cash link comes with the um in arizona they have locals that have the extra what do they call it it's the the cash link featuring a second chance but then there's some that don't have that second chance it must be a regulatory uh, implementation i'm not familiar with okay it's unique to the jurisdiction. no because in arizona you have one right next to one of the same casino and they're different yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, so, I like this cabinet. Yeah, I've not seen this right, cabinet. So right now, this is actually in the box round. But I want you to notice something. Look sure. at the wheel. And look at how I control the wheel. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. So let's spin this right now. It's I, in the bonus But round. I can't stop it on the 5,000, though. <laughs> you haven't added that feature yet. Right? <laughs> I like how seemingly it doesn't give you a tease. We think this is a new interaction between the player yes. and the wheel. Yeah, I like right? that. When players decide how fast they spin, when players decide which way the wheel spins, then they're putting the luck into the outcome. And we right. want to give them that control. Yeah, no, and I like very that. Very tactile, very precise. And with, with this game, we're actually looking at doing a, a traditional lock and respin, which has been so you know mm. powerful in the industry. We're already mid bonus with this one, mm -hmm. the other oh, that's the show. Fine. But I wanted to demonstrate right, right. how you could control that. Yeah, there you go. Oh, that, that felt very silly. So you'll see this green question mark. Uh -huh. And we have other greens that are already on the, on the floor. So let's see. I'm going to get that 700 credits there. If I had had any other green ones, they turn into would, that. it would have added to what was oh. already there. It would have added to what's already there. So if I get another green, then it's going to exactly. add. Oh. So, let's so you want greens. Oh, oh, so now it's going to add to this, to these. All these. So now, 400 credits. Oh, I would play this, totally. Let's see what we get. And this wheel spin will determine what's gonna go, oh, did you imagine Almost. a 50? Mm. Oh my God. That would have been crazy. <laughs> so now all of those have been added. We've got this many over here that we're winning at the same time, and we're getting close to a blackout, exactly what you wanted to look at. And that's a grand, right? Or no? That's not, that's we'll see. Maybe a big multiplier on. on top. And maybe this didn't gaff, but, you know, it didn't, okay. it didn't gaff it, but I will gaff it for you, so we'll see a true blackout. Yes, let's do that. You would still win through the wheel, regardless. Right. And all, Which is roads, what, all roads lead to a wheel spin. Yeah. So. And that's what Wheel of Fortune is, and I think this lives right up to it. Absolutely. This is sold as a standalone. It's not on a wide area progressive, which means that top reset is an achievable goal for yeah. players, right? They're gonna look at that and say, oh, this is a real chase here, I like this. The other thing too, just take a, take a quick look at this 49P. We got wireless charging here. We got wired charging here. It's a modern cabinet. If you've got a nice wireless phone, you don't wanna have to right. plug it in. You can sit it down right there. Everyone has really appreciated that because now your phone's not gonna go dead while you're playing the slot machine. And you certainly don't have to bring a yeah. board with you, right? Because a lot of times see that people see that, no, oh, I can't really use it. It's funny, you, it, it, it gets... So we're gonna go blackout. Some of these get a bad treatment at the casino. And exactly. when you try to plug in, so having that second option is always good. It's hard to make them last forever with all yeah, that Budweiser out there. <laughs> Blue Moon, on my channel, Blue Moon. Blue Moon. <laughs> we drink real beer. I'm sorry. <laughs> my brother works for Budweiser, so he wouldn't like that. <laughs> Every time I bring a Blue Moon, he brings me a shock top. <laughs> there we go. Oh, so now we're determining the values for the colors down here, All right? All these colors are now going to get their initial values out of the wheel spin. But if those colors come up again as we go through the bonus, right. they get more money on each one of those that have already landed. So the more you land earlier on, the more chance there is that you can add to them again and again with each subsequent spin. How many colors are there? One, two, three, four? It corresponds to this? No, no. The wheel colors are the ones that we're looking at. Okay. So. Not, not necessarily these colors. Those colors are unto themselves for the different MLPs, 
but we're looking at wheel colors on the base game and matching up wheel colors down to those base game symbols. Right, but what I'm saying is, so we have uh, yellow, purple, then we have a green, a red, and what am I, what am I missing? White. Oh, white. Oh, oh, yeah. you can get the white. I mean, if it's the white, you get either 5,000 5, credits or 1,000, right? Yeah. It's, that's a much different animal, for sure. Here we go, another wheel. Red. Gone. Big money, big money. I know, where's Vanna? We should be clapping. I know, right? <laughs> Oh, $19, nice. dollars yeah. I wish we had some more red ones right now. Oh, there you go. There we go. I would, I would die. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't want to die. I want to collect the money, right? But here we go. Look at that. That one by itself is $33. Oh, fantastic. Blackout award. There we oh, go. Now so that blackout can happen we pretty are often. Guaranteed a jackpot. Mm. One of them is definitely going to happen. Oh. All right, that, that, but it's that, not that's, the mini. That's good. It's better than the mini. Always better than the mini. But I like that. This will happen quite frequently to some degree, right? And we make a lot of we make a lot of excitement here. Now yeah. at the end, we're gonna roll this up a little bit at a time and make sure that everybody understands this is how much you want. Right. <laughs> and when is this gonna be out? So is it final yet already? Um, we're still in a little bit of development and it will be available in the first half of next year. year. Okay. Really excited about the new cabinet. Really excited about this next iteration of Wheel of Fortune. And most importantly, this is the first time we've ever used a digital wheel that the Fine. player gets to control. And the base game. Can you make money on the base game? Absolutely. All Wheel of Fortune games are about the base game. So base game pays are nice, but let's be honest. Oh, we want to go Wheel of Fortune there, yeah. players are going to want to spin yeah, the wheel. Yeah, want to spin the wheel. And we've given them the richest wheel experience ever with this game. I agree. All right. Fun, cool. fun. All right, so um, what would you, you said no links. Right. What about steppers? Sure, let's do that. How about large format? Sure. Let's, okay. Let's go for it. Excuse me. Oh, I, I played the um, Price is Right. Oh, okay, good. Thank you. Oh, oh but that, that was natural, right? Oh, man, this is Jeopardy. Yeah. So we based this on the really, really successful Triple Double Diamond math model that you see in our three-reel games. And this is a, uh, a nine-line three-reel on our, our uh, Mega Tower Universal cabinet. It's a huge cabinet. This is it's massive. Love seat. Couples can sit together and play this game, and then they can also play Double Jeopardy, Final Jeopardy. There's daily doubles. We've brought a lot of things to life from the original game, and then put it into a slot format so it's fun. So as we're spinning, every time I see one of those Jeopardy symbols, now my spins increase again. And we're keeping a tally as we go through. So you can see that the four total spins played uh -huh. so far, we want to try and give it, we want to memorialize every single spin mm -hmm. that we get. And up here is not picking, it's just random. That's random. One more spin. Nice, look at that. So we're resetting our five spins, resetting to five spins. Another 40 credits. And is that going to be white or progressive, the, the grand? This is always, you would only win those through this play. Okay. Right? Oh, is that another line? Oh, nope, we didn't get one. We had a blocker. Oh, nope. Come on, one more spin remaining. Yes. Oh, so reset to five spins. Awesome. 
another 20 credits. I love your enthusiasm, but <laughs> let me ask you one question. Sure. In the free games, whatever happens here, the only thing you're looking for is for Jeopardy bonus. Oh, no, you line hits are not. No, that should have been a line hit if it's nine lines. Yeah. Yeah, you're just getting, you're just going for the Jeopardy symbol at this point in the free spins. That's very misleading. <laughs> But what I mean is, maybe they're not lit up, and maybe I'm just not seeing it. But okay, yep. I mean, especially when I had the when we landed those triple triple, I'm like, wow, money. It would be so expensive, I wouldn't be able to provide. Oh the no, 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 no! I, 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 yeah. I get it. Yeah. But I don't, I don't know if you guys you need to like darken it. it a little bit it's more. Like all you know, the players that come in and do our player focus groups. There's a, Shouldn't the pays be bigger? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we all, we all want to hit jackpot. Oh, daily double. Oh, that's awesome. Is it everything to it or just out, just whatever just you land? We okay. Nice. More, more. Come on, we want some more. We're greedy. Oh, there were two right there. There we there go. There we go. Back to five spins again. Look at this accumulation. We've already had 22 spins so far. There we go. Nice. But Back they but they spins. are darker, so I I, I I get it. Yeah. I just don't like when I see triple, 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 and then it's like, oh my god! Oh, no. But this physical layout is pretty yeah. interesting. I mean, I think couples will enjoy playing together. Friends can sit down and play mm -hmm. together. You pull your money together and come and attack Jeopardy. And, and to be fair, if you get into a bonus like this, you're just watching. You're, oh, it's fantastic. You know, you're not losing you money. Get? Yeah. I love to sit back and see how much I'll be paid. There they go. There they go. There they go. Oh, and it adds nice. them all up at the end. Yes. Ooh. What now, does that mean? We're in Final Jeopardy. Would you like to take the $360 or do we press our luck and go after a different combination that could possibly be bigger. It could be the mini, the major, or the grand. Do we want to press our luck? I yeah, 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 of luck. course. We want to press our luck. Let's do it. And it was down here where you can select yeah, yeah, yeah. very um, top dollar. Here's our first offer, you betcha. And we also offer optimum play recommendations just like top dollar. Mm -hmm. Is the same amount, pretty much. So same amount. Let's, let's try again. It's not real money, right? It's not real money. <laughs> I like that. Is has a tub dollar still component. More to yeah, it, right. We had a mm. wonderful, wonderful experience, and now there's still more to it. Give me that grand. That's 109. We got the mini. Oh, it may it may pick something else too. No. Oh. Only the mini. Uh, we're okay. definitely trying again. <laughs> yeah. Come on, give us something huge. In a real casino, it would be the 60. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. And the sound very... Um... Very indicative of the brand. Oh, there we go. The mini. Plus something else. Plus something else. Plus another $100, I think. So we ended up with 209 Yeah. Oh, 219 so a little less than what yeah we but but it, but it was fun you it was know super fun super yeah fun. yeah and that's how you would go after the grand the major or the mini in the bonus round only in final jeopardy, only in final jeopardy. okay well that was cool super cool. fun for couples super fun for fans of jeopardy well since we're on game shows do we want right. to try the show the uh price is right on ultra sure let me i don't have to ask someone Thank you. Okay, so this is the price is right on Ultra. Ultra is the cabinet? Ultra is the cabinet. Okay. That's right. And we're going to go ahead and play this wonderful version of the price is right in a ways configuration. So no line pays, this is all ways. Oh, I'm in love now. Okay, <laughs> go ahead. Give it a couple spins. And then we'll trigger the good stuff. When we built this game, we really went out and reached out to players about 
what are the games on the show that you appreciate that you like, like the most? And we whittled it down to the top 10 games and then we made a final choice. So we've got some great games in here. Not only did we pick the player favorites and the ones that we thought players liked most from the show, but we also tried to keep them as true to form from a mathematical perspective oh, as possible. Oh, good. And in fact, the Punch-A-Bunch game is exactly the same game that they have on the show. So let's go ahead and do... Oh, Cliffhanger. Can we start with Cliffhanger? cliffhanger. There we go. It's a player favorite. The Price is Right is one of my favorite brands. At one point, they, you guys had one that it did the wheel and you go to the showcase showdown. This is like 15 years ago. That was such a fun game. So, great oh. thing about the cliffhanger bonus. Every time you go into this bonus, without fail, you will have one spin at a 25 times multiplier. Oh, guaranteed. The entire game is about keeping your climber on the hill as long as possible. And the climber is up here. He's right here in front of us. He's also up there a little bit too. So we've got our one-time spin. Go oh, ahead. so here it, tell, it tells you as well. Okay. And we're looking for him, right? And, and randomly, oh, oh, there he is. So now we're going to start climbing. Oh, this show's right here too. Awesome. Stop. Yes, five times. So every time we make a stop, we want to stay there as long as possible. <coughs> as many spins as possible. Oh, this is very Goonies when you go up and down, up and down too. Oh, yeah. We just go up, by the way. Right, right, right. No, but in the Goonies, you, you want to keep spinning on, on oh, the yeah. one that you're at. Absolutely. Yeah. I like the music. And that's authentic from the show as mm -hmm. well. Part of the licensed brand, we're going to you leverage all of the fidelity from the show. Oh, there it goes. Nine times. Let's hang out at nine for a couple spins. Yeah. Give us something good. That seems good. Oh, 38 bucks? Sure. It's really this or 250. Of accumulation as you go through the bonus because you know your later spins are going to have higher multipliers and each one of them has a higher propensity to give you a bigger win. Cleopatra. You're guaranteed the 25 times yes. oh. multiplier. That's what's awesome. So no matter what, we're going to have one at the end that's 25. I like we only moved one that time. That's nice. Oh, we're moving again. Stop. Stop. Oh, nice. Lucky number 13, bring it home. Yes. Oh yeah, 17, let's hang out here for a while. Yes. Come on. Do you foresee the max bed remaining at 250 or is that changeable based on the casino? The casino would be able to change it. I think we'll have a $5 version as well and a 750 version. Oh, wow. But again, that would be the operator's choice. But on the same token, does the max bed give you any benefit? Yes, higher pays. So the pays right, with outside, scale. right, outside of the pays. Not on frequency. Okay. Not on frequency. Pays with oh. scale. There oh, you go. do get your last spin at 25x. Come Yay. On. Oh, uh, we have the nines. Uh, you no, know, that's not bad. But this is fun. Yeah. Yeah, almost 30 times they're back. Mm -hmm. Not bad. I, I feel with your games, if they're playing, you can build your money. And sometimes, as a player, that's more important than having a $700 win now that then nothing will happen for two hours, right. you know? Right. Well, there's a lot going on in the game. There's three deep bonuses. We've tried to model everything after what the player favorites were. Price is Right is something everybody is going to be able to identify with and play their favorite mm -hmm. games from the show. Yeah. And can we do one more? Yes, for sure. Let's do Punch a Bunch. Punch a Bunch is one of those that we brought over exactly the same way as it was on the show. And this will have a little bit of a choice for you as well because after you make the selections, you have to decide if you want the next envelope. Oh. More choices for the player in this bonus. You can really win $50,000? So let's talk about that real quick. Behind all of these are envelopes. We've got one envelope in all of these that has 50,000. We've got three that have 15, six that have 10, seven that have 5,000, eight that have 3750, 10 that have 3,000, 10 that have 2,500, and five that have 1250. So at the end, whatever I pick, you reveal the symbols? You're gonna pick four. 
It's up to you. So it's not ran so it's not random. It is a real pick. And we'll do okay. a reveal afterwards. Oh, that's what I was asking. Yes. yes. Okay. So Okay, so you picked them first. Alright, let's see what we got. First envelope. Not bad. Not bad. So there's only eight of those. Oh, I'm, and he tells you here too. It says pass. And we yeah. always do that. We always give you optimal choice. Oh, totally pass. pass. Come on. Oh, that's pretty good. There's only seven of those. Will it tell me what I didn't pick? Oh, he's Will. still saying pass. Let's go. Here it is. What did we get? A hundred bucks, yay! Hey, that's nice. good, yeah. We improved it. Fantastic. So let's see where all those others were. Here comes the reveal. There it was. Oh. Down in the corner, that sneaky booter. The, the fact that it's not pretty determined, I love it. Okay. Well, yeah. Is there anything else to see? Because we can we can end it. Oh no, no, I'm just saying we have about ten minutes until our next. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Well, well, do you want to show me anything else? Because I I did love this. When will this one be out? This is going to be out in the next ninety days. So oh, see this in the sometime next year. year. Yeah. Oh, or at the end of the month. Oh, yeah, well, good. This year. Sorry, end of the year. Yeah. Cool. So we have um, another license title. You said you really like Goonies. I, uh, we played it. Yes. Yeah. Do you have it again? No, no, we don't have Goonies, but I've got Jumanji. Oh, let's try Jumanji. Let's play that board. Anything different on this one? Yes. What's different about it? So, actually, when you get into the free spins, it goes to a uh, six by five configuration. Oh. Yeah, so we're increasing the chances for you. Carnival of Wonder. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. And it's 4D. This is Jumanji. Jumanji. There's a couple of things you notice right before we start playing. You'll notice the game board, it goes all the way around the main real set on the game itself. And there's regular steps and there's gold steps. And the gold steps actually coincide with random events that'll happen in the base game, mm. including these dice that can come out. This game is offered in 4D. We'll turn that off so yeah. that your viewers can kind of see it uh, correctly. Uh, Jumanji's got a lot of deep, rich content. We're really proud of the production value of this game. And in 4D, players are going to be mesmerized. So, And was this design here or... Um, oh, What happened there? We, we didn't get a jackpot. We just got a, a little bit of a tease. Oh, so you would have to do jackpot, jackpot, jackpot. Oh. Yes. So on two, three, and four. So nice, simple set, beautiful graphics. Let's get into some of the cool features. The first one is the dice feature. It'll randomly roll the dice, and then you'll get a selection of wilds that'll be propagated onto the screen. Oh, so it can be a little simple or big simple. And, and we... Nice. But there are no real characters have no bearings on the game, or yeah? Yes, they do. Okay. They do. Especially when they're right in front of a yellow one. So things happen randomly. You don't know what type of effect you're going to get. Oh, so that's like the, um, that other one that has the little poppet balls that if you get four, then you... Oh, my God. I forget what it is. Maybe similar to that. Oh. Here we go. Bonus. Take your game to the next level. Let's do it. Is this Jumanji the first one or the second one? Uh, this is actually Jumanji the book. So this is just... Oh, open. okay. This is... We're not going to see the rock coming in or crazy. No, no, no. no nothing like that. Okay. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Nice intro. 
wheel bonus. Important to note that the player gets to choose. Just go ahead and hit the start button to spin. Oh my god, I thought it was going I know, right? Oh my god. We don't want snakes, I assume. Ah, oh, we did it! Uh, yes! Woo. Nice. Randomly uh, selects which one's not to turn to snake. Okay. Right. Stop, stop, yes! Yes, oh man, this is, you're doing it. Yeah. This is good, this is a good outcome. Hopefully it will happen in the, in the casino floor, yeah, whatever exactly. I can play it. 75, 75, stop, stop, stop. Yes! Oh, it's getting dicey now. Woo! Okay. We can do it. Come on. This is real math right now, right? Yes. Stop, 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 stop. Yes! <laughs> oh my god. I can't believe it. Okay. Now we should turn into multipliers. <laughs> <laughs> Level up the wheel. <laughs> hey, but it was pretty much cleared. I mean, it's $550 on a $4 bet. That's wow. amazing. Yeah. Well over 100 times that. A lot of rich content. What's up? Energy, all kinds of great stuff. Ooh, I like big numbers like that. And again, this will be available in 4D, and it'll also be available on our Ultra cabinet in regular 2D oh, as okay. well. Oh, okay. So both cabinets will support the capability. And later this year too. Uh, this is going to be a little later next year. Okay. But it'll be before the the second half of 2020. Okay. Well, I do want to thank. Lynn and, and Joe for being with us today. Thanks Thank for you guys. Bye. Bye guys. Play some ICT games. We'll see you later. Bye.